Hi friends, how are you? I hope you are in the best state of faith, health, success and religion fellowship. Today our video topic is obesity. Basically obesity is a complex disease involving an excessive amount of body fat. Obesity is not a just a cosmetic concern. It's a medical problem that increases the risk of other diseases and health problems such as heart diseases, diabetes, high blood pressure and certain cancer. Today we are discussing symptoms and causes of obesity and uh, solution will discuss in next video. Now one important thing is body mass index. Uh, simply is BMI. Body mass index is a calculation that takes a person weight and height into account major body size. In adult, obesity is defined as having a BMI of 30 or more. Obesity is associated with a higher risk for serious diseases such as type 2 diabetics, heart diseases and cancer. Now we are showing a BMI scale on screen. There are six classification of obesity in BMI for adults who are at least 20 year old. First BMI is if 18.5 or under that is underweight. Second standard is 18.5 to 25 BMI is normal weight. But 25 to 30 uh, BMI is uh, overweight. 30 to 35 is class 1 obesity. 35 to 40 is class 2 obesity and 40 or over is class 3 obesity is also known as morbid, extreme or severe obesity. Now the very important thing is BMI or body mass index is not everything. It has some limitation as a metric according to the uh, CDC factors such as age, sex, ethnicity and muscle mass can influence the relationship between BMI and body fat. Also BMI does not distinguish between excess fat, muscles or bone mass. Nor does it provide any indication of the distribution of fat amongst individuals. Despite these limitations, BMI continue to be widely used as a way to measure body size. Now I start the classes of obesity. Eating more calories than you burn in daily activity and exercise on a long term basis can lead to obesity. Over time these extra calories add up and cause weight gain. But it is not always just about calories in and calories out. Some uh, causes you can control but some causes you cannot control. Some common specific causes of obesity like genetic which can affect how your body process food into energy and how fat is stored. Second thing is growing older which can lead to less muscle mass and a slower metabolic rate make it easier to gain weight. The third thing is not sleeping enough which can lead to hormonal change that makes you feel hungrier and curve certain high calories food. The last thing is pregnancy as weight gain during pregnancy may be difficult to lose and uh, might eventually lead to obesity and uh, certain health conditions can also lead to weight gain which may lead to obesity some are uh, like uh, polycystic ovary syndrome, uh, predator ovary syndrome a rare condition present at birth that cause excessive hunger and Cushing syndrome, hypothyroidism and osteoarthritis and other conditions that cause pain that may lead to in reduce activity. Now the very important thing is whose obesity is at risk. A complex mix of factors can increase a person's risk of obesity like genetics. Some people have genes that make it difficult for them to lose weight. Environment and community, your environment at home, at school and in your community can all influence how and what you eat and how activity you are. Uh, you may be at higher risk uh, uh, if your obesity is live in a neighborhood with limited healthy food option or with many high calories food option like fast food restaurant 
you may be at a higher risk for obesity if you haven't yet learned to cook healthy meal you may be at higher risk for obesity if you do not think you can afford healthier food and also you may be at higher risk for obesity if you haven't found a good place to play walk or exercise in your neighborhood depression can sometimes lead to weight gain as some people may turn to food for emotional comfort certain antidepressant can also increase the risk of weight gain to get rid of smoking is always a good thing but quitting may lead to weight gain too in some people it may lead to excessive weight gain for the reason it's important to focus on diet and exercise while you are quitting at least after the initial withdrawal period now it is a big challenge that how is obesity diagnosed bmi is a rough calculation of a person weight in relation to their height other more accurate measure of body fat and body fat distribution includes like skin fold thickness test waist to hip comparison screening test such as ultrasound ct scan and mri scan please consult your doctor or physician on time when you feel some obesity your doctor may also order certain test to help diagnose obesity related health risk maybe this blood test to examine cholesterol and glucose level and uh, liver functioning test lft or a diabetic screening test thyroid test heart test such as an electrocardiogram ecg a measurement of the fat around your waist is also a good pre doctor of your risk to obesity related diseases today we are discussing only obesity information and its causes in uh, tomorrow video we will discuss the uh, remedy for the obesity i requesting to you kindly subscribe my channel healthcare and share my videos to your relatives your well wisher and your lovers till tomorrow bye bye